deal. Twenty-two boxes. A quarter of a million pounds. Just one question. Welcome to deal. On Start of a brand new week, and we are we're feeling very good here. At least I'm feeling very, very good about these people. Uh, I must compliment them. We've had some sensational games in the last week. Very emotional games, but there's been two eyes. There have been inspirational games. And uh, we had a very intelligent game yesterday with Terry. Because I would totally understand, in the current climate, people coming along here and maybe not being able to find that little extra bit of courage because they think, yeah, that money is really, really important to me. And Terry said, if I get to 20,000, I think I'm going to go. And uh, he did get an offer of 20,000, but he was intelligent enough to realise, actually, there's a lot more in this game. And there was a lot more. He went away with £41,000. So it's important to be brave. It's important to have your targets. But I think there's a lesson there. It's important to see the way the game is going. Get the max out of it. Here come the players. In fact, we used to say that the best players feel the game. Try your best. Ginge. You challenged me at the beginning when you first arrived. Najinda Jinj Kalhari. <laughs> Close. Go on. <laughs> it's Naginda Kohe. Oh, nowhere near. Yeah. So it's so, RG, Naginda. Yeah, Naginda. And tell me about work. What do you do? Okay, I'm a senior personal advisor and I work with young people. I work with the 13 to 19 year olds who are the hardest to reach. Uh, predominantly, they come from um, dysfunctional families. Um, and my role, if you like, is to work with that young person to try and get them to make a successful transition into either education, employment or training. Imagine very, very rewarding. Yeah. Uh, tell me about the army you've brought with you. I oh, know. It's, it's great. Um, I've got there my older sister. Okay. Oh, and, um, does she have a name? Yes, it's Jaswinda. For every call, it's a jazz. And oh, then, I, know. <laughs> I know. And then next to her is my lovely best friend. She's absolutely fantastic. She's been there for me through everything. Does she have a name? Yes, she does. <laughs> this is Raj. Raj, very Hi. nice to meet you. Now, I know this is China. Yeah, and just below him, that's my husband. <laughs> and who is this? Okay, this is um, the apple of my eye. This is Bobby. He was one there, and he's just absolutely everything. You're kind of misleading people here because he's 21. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, he is. He is 21 now, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, right, okay, okay. fine. That, that was when he was one. They were okay. all thinking, oh, she's got a little one. Yeah, and here he is now, guys. Oh, yeah, no, that's a little sour. Now, come yeah, on. First one, I'll go with you on the R, but that, that's yeah. a 21-year-old bloke. That's my boy. Yeah, he's absolute. You know what? And he's not just my boy. He, he's my friend. Oh, he's fantastic. Like he's Every time I need him, he's there. Lovely. All right, well, I feel as if we got to know you now. Thank you. What's that? Okay, this little thing here, um, it was um, something that was given to me and I hung it over his um, crib. It was a rabbit, so it were hairs. So um, I've always kept it in his room and it's sort of, I think it brings him luck and me. That's it. 
No other reason. If it works for you, yeah. that's all we need. That's it. Happy to go? I am, yes. Okay, I need you please to confirm you chose box number two at random before this game began. I did know. It is sealed by the independent adjudicator who seals all 22 boxes. Lovely lady, and she's the only person who knows where the money is. Oh, yeah. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Let me look at you. No, you're touchy-feely. You won't have a system. No, I haven't. No system at no all? No system at all. But do you gamble? I do have to say that, yeah, I'm probably the one who does the gambling. China's the sensible one. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. So. All right, Ginge, I wish you all possible. Good luck. Thank you. As I've said, I've got no system. Um, I did think of a couple of numbers that I was going to keep back, but I'm not going to worry about those just yet. So, I think what we'll do, we'll start off with the lovely Kerry, and she's done her hair especially for everybody today, guys. Good luck, Jen. Thank you. £10,000. OK. Seventeen, Ronnie, please. Good luck. Yeah. 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 Uh, I'm going to go with Kaz. No. Yes. She's a lovely lady. She's been fantastic. A lot of support. You're really inspirational. We've sat at length and chatted, and I'm honoured to call you my friend. Oh, oh. thank you. Thanks, Kaz. Hope this is a lifelong friendship for both of you. <gasps> Don't worry. Don't worry, mate. That must be the shortest lifelong friendship there's ever been. <laughs> Thank you, Rob. Good luck. Three grand. Okay, I'm going to go with our newbie, Andrew, please. Hello, Andrew. Hello. Where did we get you from? I come from Woking, in Surrey. Good to have you with us, Andy. Thank you. Fire away, please. Good luck, Ginge. Good balance. Well, it was going quite well till your friend yeah. got involved. Because uh, th that's made the banker very happy. He loves yeah. those tributes that are then followed by a real stab in the back. Hello, banker. With a bit of sweet irony, yes. Oh, he loves that. Favourite part of the show, that is. Yes, you've been looking forward to this game. Yes. Formidable lady. Thank you very much. Became quite serious there, pointing out that when you take out one of the whoppers in the opening round, the second round becomes even more significant. £4,250 is the value of your box. Silence. Four, two, fifty. It's a lot of money. I haven't got that in my savings account. <laughs> um, but I'm ready for the question now. Oh, my word. £4,250, deal or no deal? No deal. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to go with the lovely Emma. Ginger, we're all going to miss you, sir. Good luck. Thank you. Oh, okay. Good. 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 Go on. 1p, 10p or 50p? Yeah, let's find that 1p. I looked over at Craig earlier, then I went to Emma. So I'm going back to Craig. Good luck, Ginger. Thank you. Yeah! Yeah! He, he 
said it in the call. If you take out a big number in the opening round, the second round is even more crucial. Taking out the 1P before the break. Oh, good move, that. Yeah, yeah. Why should they come back to your game, Ginge? Right, OK, well, my name's Ginge. And you'd be nuts if you don't come back. Yeah? before the break and I think if you could have the 10p now the banker would have to be extremely concerned about you okay uh, I'm gonna go with Michelle no please number eight thank you Michelle Good luck, Excellent second round, redress the balance. So what's that do to the valuation of the box? Linda's got something on this card. Uh, yeah, she wants to get at least eight and a half thousand pounds. So to, uh, to pay for Bobby's master's degree, all right. You, you put down here about Bobby, an A-grade student, and you would like nothing more than to have enough money to fund the eight and a half thousand pounds he needs to pay for his master's degree. Yes. So uh, he's now offering you eight and a half thousand pounds, and if you don't take it, you don't love your son. That's a very good offer. He is amazing incredible ability to be nice and nasty at the same time. Okay, that is a, that's a very generous offer, but I'm going to need a bit more than that, and I've got a good board. What do you need to uh, spend the money on there? Okay, um, well, uh, first, Obviously I would like, master. of course, to give to my brothers and sisters, but more so, I suppose, um, to my sister who's in the audience, jazz. which is Jazz. Good. I'd like, so whatever I sort of win, I'd like to give her half. And the reason for that... Half? Yeah, yeah. She rarely puts herself first. It's always about giving to her children. Oh. And even when we go out, it's oh, like, well done, you know... You. Yeah, she does. Oh, she's, a, she's a bit <laughs> of a yeah, her for her all of us. Well done, Jess. <laughs> We're going to have to see the confession, yeah. really, aren't we? Yeah. yeah. So, uh, to sort this one, this is a big one. Yeah. You'd like the question? Yeah. Eight and a half thousand pounds, deal or no deal? Thank you, Mr. Banker, but no deal. <laughs> Thank you, Jim. I'm going to go with the lovely Paul. I've had such a lot of support from him. Lots of love, lots of hugs, lot of kisses, everything. Hey. So we'll go with Paul. What was the blue gent? 35,000. <laughs> No, I'll keep looking at Ryan, but I want to keep that. I want to keep 19. And I said I wouldn't do this, but it's my birthday on the 19th. It's China's birthday on the 19th. It's Bobby's birthday on the 19th. So, Alex, what are you getting? Are you getting yeah, a feeling about your yeah. box? I think it was a blue, isn't it? It's one definitely. Okay, okay, right. Well, okay. it's up to you. And he is good, actually. Yeah, he, he is good. He's very good. Uh, okay, then, Alex, let's give me a blue. Good luck. <laughs> game is one that nobody dare miss. It's going to be fascinating. Okay, um, I'm going to go with Bibbs. Bibbs has really made me laugh she's so scratching. much. She's scratching again. Yeah, she's scratching. That's you know what it is? Well, I use um, um, a special detergent for my sheets, but when I don't, I get a reaction. Oh, do you? Yeah. A little sort of skin allergy thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's horrible. Okay. You ready, Ginge? Yeah. Certainly hope this is up to scratch. <laughs> 
Oh my god! He does this all the time. You ready? Yeah. That is going to make him very Jeez. happy. Very, very happy indeed. Oh, Ginge, what a nightmare round. Yeah, 35,000, then topped with the caution. Oh, crumbs. Well, he says it's clearly going downhill. Get out now while you can with two grand. Oh, groans all round, but what about that? 35,000, quarter million. Uh, I'm ready for the question now. 2,000 pounds, deal or no deal. Thank you, Mr. Banker, but no deal. Thank you. Okay, I've looked at Anita a few times, so I'm going to go with Anita, please. Number 12. Come on, let's get this back over the left-hand side and get back up to sensible money. Five grand. Okay. Two, two blues for balance, that's what you've got to do. Yeah. Had a lot of nice advice from Mike yesterday as well. In fact, I've had a lot of great advice from everyone. So let's hope you can give me a blue, Mike. Ginge, smashing girl, China. Wish you all the best of luck. Oh. No. Take a break. Yeah. Yeah. What are you thinking about this situation? I'm going to try and turn this around. I've seen, I have seen it being done. And you know what? We're going to keep positive. So please come back and watch them again. Yeah. A sincere message. I can't do better than that. She needs to turn it around. go with Dickie, I think. Number yeah. 13. Okay. Oh, oh, actually, hang on, hang on. Oh. You know, in our culture, Friday the 13th is supposed to be lucky for us. But, you know what, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll go with that. Come on, Dickie, I need... Come on, Dickie! Need we want that 10 Dickie! Come on, Dickie! Oh. 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 with only two reds. Oh. Not good. Okay, this is not going good, guys. Don't do any more. We've got enough of a problem. <laughs> Sit down, woman. We need to regroup. Hello? Yeah, it is a hard ball to play, isn't it? I, I can't recall that configuration for a very long time, actually. No small reds, just a meaty 20 and a mega 75. Yeah, you see, on this board, he can afford to risk a low offer. Yeah, of course he can, yeah. Okay, he's doing it. I mean, he did say that he admires you enormously, and if there is one person who can turn triumph out of adversity, particularly in view of the work you do, then undoubtedly it is you. Right. Uh, but he sees no reason to overvalue this box at all. There is so little for him to fear in this situation. A thousand pounds. 
Okay. I think that's a very good offer, to be honest with you, the way the board is. It's a lot of money. We've enjoyed ourselves, and a thousand pounds is a lot of money at the end of the day. Yeah, but you know what? A thousand pounds is a lot of money. But I'm ready for the question now. Okay. Right. Uh, a thousand pounds. Deal or no deal? No deal. Thank you. Now we're going to put him on the okay. rack. You know, yeah. uh, you have to accept the fact he had nothing to lose there at all. Um, and all blue round now, you'll get you'll get him concentrating big time. Right, I'm going to go with Shaz, please, Noel. Okay, Shaz, we're going to be really confident. Yep. Give me one of those blues. Okay, good luck, Ginge. Yep. Come on, let's make a thousand pounds a distant memory. I'm going to go with Claire. Okay, not worried about death box reputation or whatever. Claire, uh, open box 22, please, okay. and give us a blow. Good luck, Ginge. One, just the one will do it. Uh, Ange, are you getting any feelings? Not today. No feelings today. Okay, yeah. We'll go three. with number three, please, now. Okay. Well, we know what we don't want to see. Ange, all blue round. That's what we asked for. Would you complete it, please? Oh! Oh! Oh, no, we couldn't do it. That was a cruel blow. I mean, the point he was making before was there was nothing in that configuration that we had at eight box that really meant he had to take a gamble. It, he felt very safe and therefore went very low. Mm. And uh, you're so precarious now. All or nothing. Yeah. How you feeling? Uh, I'm all right. You no. seem yeah. very relaxed. Yeah. You seem very yeah. calm, Ginge. Yeah, I'm okay. Hello. I'm right. Oh, it could have been worse. And, 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 you know, the thing, you've, you've got to commend her. I mean, honestly, the way Ginge is taking this is, is fantastic. Right. Okay. What you might like to do, this might help, retain the first thought that goes through your head when I say the sum of money. Your box, he would now like to buy for £3,750. Now that is, I think you'd agree, China, a very respectable sum of money. Very, very respectable. Yeah, it is. It's a, it's a great sum of money. It is lovely. And it'd be nice to, you know, even give that to Bobby. And just, because he's just one of these kids that just never, ever wants to have anything off us. So, yeah, that's, that's great. That's, that's, that's great. Dare I say it? most unusual. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this, this is what I say. He is, he's just a, he's, he's like a golden Hello. child. Yeah, she's made it very clear she wants eight and a half thousand pounds for her fine 21 year old son, Bobby. Yes, and she's made it clear that half her winnings go to jazz. <laughs> oh, he's good, he's good. If you go on and you have an all blue round, He'll give you 17,000 for the box. That gets Bobby <coughs> through the university. He gets a slug of money for jazz. Yep, that's a, that's a good gamble. What a carrot. I like that. Good gamble. What do you think, guys? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't go for it. Ginge, remember last night at dinner when we were talking about courage? We all know you've got the courage to go on. Yeah. Have you also got the other half of it, the courage to go home with a blue? You've got a cracking offer there bearing what's on that board. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for your advice. But I'm ready for the question now.
course is going to be interesting. Three thousand seven hundred and fifty pounds. Do your note. Just, uh, it's, it's just one of those rounds. They come every now and again where I don't need to say anything. We all know you've got to miss it. Right, I'm going to go with Mary. No, please. Okay, Mary, you're the first box of the all-important three. Thank you. Please, number 20. Rio, pull the seal on box 20 for me. Open it. The next box is worth seventeen thousand pounds to you. It's nine or nineteen. Where are you going, left or right? Okay. Right. You know what? I think I'm going to go, Noel. I'm going to go with Carl, please. Number nine. Change. I hope it is, but I'm really scared on this one because I got two oh, big ones sorry, yesterday. What was that? What was that? Go on, sorry, Carl. I'm really scared about this one. Yeah. You're scared about yeah. it? Yeah, I had the big ones yesterday. Okay. Like three big ones in five up to now, so. So it's your game. Well, Ginch, Ginch. 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 With, with it, yeah. Carl, she's sticking with it. Open yeah. nine. Please be wrong. Hope it is right for you. Yeah, right for her, wrong for you. Go on. Good luck. A player is useless at this game. <laughs> I am delighted to know. Totally it. useless. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh dear. Right, well, we've got a flavour of what's going to happen now. Hello. Yeah, he says, Bobby, enjoy your masters. The offer is £17,000. 17 grand! Yeah. Well, are you going to go for the biggie? Oh, oh, oh. We've all been concentrating on this 17,000 because you said very openly in your file that you wanted the 8,500 so your 21-year-old son could complete his master's degree and then you wanted to give half your, your winnings to your sister Jazz and, and that's how we've ended up at 17,000 but let's face it, uh, Ginge, this could be one of the big all-time turnarounds if you decide to decline 17,000 and you've got 75k in this box it does go down as one of the biggest turnarounds after a relentlessly disappointing game yeah, it's a fantastic offer. She's really having much. a think about it. I'm having a think about it, guys. <laughs> you know, yeah. there was a feeling here that because it was 17, that was it, game over. But it's not over, it's still alive. She's thinking about it. As I say, you know, I am. Um, it is, and that, that, that's a fabulous offer that would pay for his masters, and we could get everybody everything. Give Raj, my sister. But I've got this devil inside of me. <laughs> Good devil. Uh, and I really, you know what, sometimes... I'm only going to be here once, you see. 
Yeah. Here once. Ginge, would you like the question? China, any feelings? What do you think? I'm not the gambling person. Uh, no, you, are, you right? see, this is it. I mean, there's a lot you can do with seventeen thousand pounds if you think about everything you can do. You know, mm. but it's down to you, your game. Yeah. And, yeah. You know, I'm not trying to put pressure on you, but. <laughs> you, 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 you came here for... Yeah, I think that's pressure, no, actually. <laughs> you came here, not, not, you're not a greedy person. You know, no, you, you're doing no. everything for everybody else, right? So, yeah. enough is there what you want. Can I have Chinese? Absolutely. Absolutely. I was about to ask you yeah. wanted the question. Come on, Chinese, you're down here. You're the gambling person. I mean, oh, I'll stick with what you, whatever you do, you know, I will, you know. Well, I think you know where my thoughts are. Yeah, I do. I need to come over to my, bit, my <laughs> side of it. Here it comes. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Change. £17,000. Deal or no deal? I'm just, no, that's what I'm talking about, but you know, I just want to talk about music. Hello. <laughs> he said, nice one, my old China. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. Okay, thank you. I'd like, please, an honest response to this, Ginge. Yeah. Uh, if we had played on... I would have been saying swap or no swap. You see, no, I would have swapped. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's find out how it would have played out. Thank you, right? Thank you. Yeah, I know, but sometimes. Right. So, you were quite clearly wrestling with yourself. Would you kindly sit in the chair, please? Clearly wrestling with your emotions there. The contrast between the two of you could not be greater. He is the staid, sensible one. He believes hard work gets you the rewards in life. Fair comment? That's right, yes. You, on the other hand, have this naughty streak. <laughs> and you did not want to turn your back on the opportunity of a lifetime. If we played right through, you would have swapped. This now becomes the destiny of the game. Had you had the courage to ignore your husband? <laughs> Here we go. Should you have had seventy-five thousand? Oh, 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 oh my God! Forty odd minutes ago, you brought seven hundred and fifty pounds to the table. Would you please open it up, Brian? Complete the game. So happy for you two. There it is. Oh, it's a sweet, isn't it? All right, let's talk about it because quite clearly uh, there's all sorts of emotions going through your mind at the moment. Uh, you really, really wanted to go for it. And if yeah. you had, it would have panned out and you would have gone away mm. with our third largest prize. As it is, you got £17,000. That's got to be good news. Oh, God, yeah. Yeah, it has. I mean, obviously, it'll pay. 
pay for Bobby's masters and he's going to be debt free and uh, you know I can give to to everybody as well so that that's cool good with excellent you Thank well you good luck much. with that wonderful work you do with the young people yeah that okay. much needed work yeah. and uh, I, I'd, I'd love to be travelling home with you listening to the conversation <laughs> between <laughs> you two I I think so I think. I think this is going to be interesting no, China very pleasure to meet you. you and I'm so delighted that I am saying not £750 because it could have gone the yes. other way yeah. but £17,000. Enjoy that. <laughs> I, think, I think that's a fascinating dynamic. Ooh, she really was a gambler. She really wanted to go for it. But hey, we've made a whole family happy. We'll see you tomorrow. I can promise you another great show. They all are. See you. Well, next to Paul, Leona Lewis and Sandy Toxvick on the Paul O'Grady Show.